Now the San Diego Rescue Mission expanding into the South Bay. It's all part of an effort to address the homelessness crisis across our county. So the organization will have a new property here that will provide shelter to about 160 people. CBS 8's Dana Marie McNichol joins us live now with more details on the temporary housing here. Dana Marie. Well, good morning. I'm standing here at the South Bay Community Church, the old property that the San Diego Rescue Mission just purchased to create a navigation center. Now, I just spoke to the CEO, and my first question to him was, how is a navigation center different from a homeless shelter? And I learned that it's the first step in a long process to getting people the help they need. This is not a emergency shelter. And the difference between an emergency shelter and a navigation center is that we won't be providing daily services to people living on the streets. We'll only be providing services for people who are in our program. In other words, it's not a soup kitchen. You can't just come here and get a meal. You can't just come here and get a blanket. You can't just come here and get clothing. Now that was Donnie D, the CEO of the San Diego Rescue Mission, who says that the South Bay is one of the fastest growing cities with homeless population. Now the mayor and the city council will tell you that this is a huge issue and don't know what to do about it, he shares with me, and it's time to change that. So this 3,300 square foot building will provide services and shelter for 160 people, men, women, and families who are without housing. Now residents of this program will be transported here through their outreach team. People have to be admitted and stay the full 30 days in this program. They can't leave. Now, the National City Navigation Center will provide on-site meals, a laundry service, a computer lab, and storage area for guests. That San Diego Rescue Mission cause manager will, um, case manager will meet with guests within two days of their arrival to create an action plan to leading those programs and housing opportunities. So again, uh, this is just the first step in many different opportunities that these people have through the San Diego Rescue Mission. Now this land behind me, this uh, large plot of land as well as part of this. Uh, I was being told that they could potentially create low income housing for this area. They have a lot of plans for this. It won't be open uh, until next year. They do have some renovations that need to be taking place. In the meantime, the community here is still being able to use uh, their building. For example, there was a community church play being rehearsed right now. So still being used for good until the San Diego Rescue Mission turns this into a fully uh, functioning navigation center in the South Bay. I'm Dana Marie McNichol. I'll send it back to you.